Okay, guys, we're back playing some more Stardew Valley. Where we left off, I basically got nothing done. I kept dying and passing out. They kept having to, like, drag me home, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Um, however, I did do some off-screen farming, which I know. Every time someone says that, it's like they come back with, like, a house made out of diamonds. But I all I did was clear out my farm area like got rid of the sticks and trees and stone from a good chunk of it and then somehow i entered into like a cutscene, and then i quit out of the game really quick so i don't know if we're gonna load into this cutscene or what i mean let's hope because it looks kind of important <laughs> there was like a church or something maybe i don't really remember let's see hopefully it's there we were talking to the old dude i don't remember what his name was okay so we spawned back into the house and i don't know i don't think that's a good thing honestly we'll see somebody told me to turn on the tv oh my god i'm getting my fortune told if you seek hidden knowledge you've come to the right place well period laid on me the spirits are mildly per 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 perturbed guys oh, i'm gonna be honest with you i was a covid graduate so my uh my understanding and my spelling is not that great well the weather i mean like we can hear it's raining but like i guess it's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow okay well it's raining today my fireplace is on it's kind of cozy. okay let's see if we can get the cutscene again it's not even raining oh the fire it was the fireplace that was making that noise it wasn't raining okay great glad to know that we know that okay so as you can see I cleared out this whole area because it was looking drab before. I really only did this section and like one tree over there. So that's that's it. I didn't do much. Oh, and I um watered my um I'm gonna be honest, I forgot what was even planted what we even planted over here. Like beets or like radishes or something. It was something weird like that. Like something dumb. Like who's eating beets and radishes? Like not me. Oh, and over here we have this is a miscellaneous uh seed, and then this is a potato. I walked over here. And then the cutscene happens, so let's hope. Oh, okay, perfect! Guys, this is- this was it, y'all. It's, um, John. What's his name? Lewis. Okay, not John. This is the church I was talking about. It's definitely not a church. It's definitely not a church. Maybe, like, a town hall. What an eyesore. What did you just call me? This is the Pelican Town Community Center. What's left of it, anyway? Okay. And what do you want me to do about that? Always bustling with activity. Okay, it used to be the pride and joy, so why did they let it go if it was their pride and joy? These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. Okay, so then put a TV in the community center. And they can engage with the TV together. Like, why not? I sound like an old fool. Well, period. Yeah, you do. Joa Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Ugh. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Oh, well. Let's go inside. Um, we're probably gonna get tetanus. I don't think I want to go inside. Okay, or just do it anyway. Ooh! girl this place needs help this place needs a broom some clorox wipes a couple of two by fours i guess vincent and joss must have been playing in there who's vincent and joss joss what is that thing is that a talking apple are we having like are we having like hallucinogens what is it called hallucinogen 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 hallucinations are we having like hallucinations from all the dead air in here from the mold spores on the walls where like thinking talking apples exist what's the matter are you ill well yes the the fumes from the mold in the walls in here the black mold spores are literally making me tweak out and also i just got tetanus and a splinter you saw something i wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats you're the only rat in here lewis what is that that's creepy actually i thought this was a farm game not like a mythical creature game look i'm gonna head home i need some lunch okay so you're first of all you just trauma dumped and lore dumped on me about this decrepit old abandoned building you brought me inside knowing that this place could literally kill someone the ceiling could collapse at any moment truly i mean come on now and now you're like oh i'm hungry i'm gonna leave bye you can just hang out in here. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. I'm a busy woman. 
Lewis, okay? I'm a farming woman. I'm busy. I got rocks to break, okay? And geodes to put on the anvil. I just want an oven to cook my food. Like, I don't want, you know, extra tasks. Hey, who's this? I've never seen this girl. Maru, have you met my mother? She's the town's carpenter? Oh my god, Sabrina Carpenter is your mother. Oh, <gasps> T, she is mother. Oh wait, that's um redhead lady. Yes, yeah, from the beginning. Okay, I know now. Oh look, she's coming to greet me. Hey Diva, I really forgot her name truly. Robin. Hey, do you need your own machine or blueprints? My shop is the place you're looking for. Okay, well, where do I purchase? Why does everyone like live in their shop? Okay, or just leave. Why do you have a meth lab, by the way? Beaker set. Oh my god, she's literally cooking up dope in the crock pot. So where do I do I like have to go into your bedroom and like scrape up the blueprints off the floor? Oh, it's Maru's bedroom. Okay, well maybe the register. Where did I just go? Did I just sneak into the emo's room? Oh my god, Sebastian. Last episode, Sebastian like called me stupid and was like, You don't understand me. Down at the fish pier. Y'all, and he's like a gamer nerd. We might have to get into Sebastian's room one day. Hey, Sebastian, I'm at your door. So, Robin is Sebastian's mother? That's crazy. That's some crazy lore. The shop's closed. You literally said, hey, if you need anything, if you need anything at all, just come by the store. And I said, girl, I'm in the store. <laughs> Which means, you know, I'm looking to purchase. You walked right out the door, and now you're at aerobics club. Can Hubby come and help me at least? Hey, Hubster. Demetrius. This valley has a very vibrant and diverse ecosystem. That's one reason I was excited to move here. Okay, nerd. I feel like this place wasn't open before. I just don't remember it. I can't believe Sebastian is Robin's kid. That's just insane. Who is this man? Why does he look like a literal caveman? Eat daffodil? Well, no. I'm trying to speak to the man. I thought the man was named Daffodil for a second because as soon as I clicked on him, it said eat Daffodil. Hey, Linus. Have you come to ridicule me? Oh, Diva, I was already doing that before I even stepped foot into this conversation. I'm just minding my own business. All right, okay, fine. What, guys? Seriously, somebody let me know in the comments. What are these, like, weird statues? Is there, like, secret lore? Is that why the apple was, like, dancing? Ooh, is this the mine? The local mine? And here's a spooky man with an eye patch in here. Marlin. Hey, Marlin. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. What happened to hello? How are you? My name is. There's probably good ore down there, but a dark place undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Take this, you might need it. Oh, he's giving me gift. <gasps> I got a sword. I didn't even know you could like fight people in this game. Name's Marlin, by the way. Yeah, that should have been the first thing you said. Can I go in? Or is this a bad idea? Hey, look at me. Wait, why is it all stone? I want like riches, not stones. Oh, I have a health bar now. So if I die, does all my stuff drop like Minecraft? Or do I get to keep it? Because I would prefer to keep it. Oh, ooh, new hole unlocked. Dude, th is this a speed run? Like world record? How fast I just mined all this garbage? Okay, let's go. Ooh, the speed- Ooh, I'm about to die. Should I eat the daffodil? Yes. That gave me like no health. Thanks for nothing. Oh my god, there it is. That little, that little, uh, ooh, there's something special over here. So should I fight this thing or what? Oh, I'm, I'm losing bad. I'm losing to the apple. Okay, the gameplay on this, uh, fighting situation is not good. Oh, because I was hitting dodge, not, I was, um, I was playing defense, not attack. That was super embarrassing. Wow. Okay, come here. Gold? A gold doubloon? Topaz? No, I wanted a gold doubloon. I want topaz. I don't like these ghoulish noises that are happening. Okay, I'm about to die, so I think I need to go. Because I'm not trying to pass out in this cave, can't lie. Oh, this little minecart is like kind of adorable. Can I go in here? Or no? Out of order. Okay, well that's bogus. Who is this gentleman? I think we need to pay this gentleman a visit. Wait, are you kidding? Dude, I want to see this, this, this ghoul over here. It looks like he's going to ask me a riddle for riches. Okay, well, there's nothing I can really do besides eat my daffodil. Uh, why did I think that was going to do something when it did nothing the first time? You know what I mean? Like, I'm just dumb. What is this? What is this spooky dookie area here? 
Oh, I'm about to die. I might just have to like take the L and pass out real quick so I can respawn at home. Ooh, or I can seek refuge in this tent here. Unless that creepy guy from earlier lives in the tent. What was his name? Midas? What was his name? I walk right- God, oh my god, I'm, I'm stuck in the tent with the creeper. Thanks for letting me in, but I'm gonna promptly leave. I've never been in this area. I'm like up in the in the gulag. Oh wait, this is like a shortcut home, right? I'm literally almost home. Oh my god, I actually made it home without dying. Dude, that's actually insane. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. A few moments later. The spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Awesome, yeah. Well, that's just like every day for me in real life, so it's fine. Yeah, A. And who may you be harassing me at this hour? Hey, Clint. <laughs> he looks like queso. I notice you've been breaking rocks open, finding some ore. That's good. Hey, are you stalking me? How would you know that? If you want to get the most out of the ores you'll find, you'll need furnace. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around here. Here, I want you to have them, so I have to build it myself. This is like Ikea. You couldn't even just give me a furnace? Or make me a furnace? You have to give me the blueprints to a furnace? <laughs> What do I look like to you, Handy Manny? When you smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make you work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. Bye, Clint. Thanks for nothing, I guess. Oh my god, look! Wait, I can pick them now. Hold on. I can pick the radishes now. Oh, I'm out of inventory. Okay, guys, we're gonna pick them. It's a parsnip. That's what it was, okay. So I picked them and then now what? I don't have no more seeds. Oh my god, this is... Guys, we're racking up the situations here. Reach farming level one and craft a scarecrow. Build a coop. Damn. Y'all, y'all, damn. I gotta do the rats first, please. Let me do the rats first. We're gonna go check out the rats, because that's, that's, we're, we're following the order of operations here, okay? Because now there's a lot going on. Oh my goodness, come here right now. No. Dang, I wanted that squirrel. I wanted to cook that squirrel in my new furnace. I'm just kidding. I That's not what I wanted to do with the squirrel. I wanted to give it a kiss. Where's that gosh darn... Uh, look, that apple is over here in the corner. All right, I guess I gotta go murk this apple thing. What up? So what is this? Oh, what is that? Can I pick it up? Oh, there we go. Hey man, I don't speak hieroglyphics, unfortunately. Uh, you could have caught me like, you know, maybe in 200 AD, I would have understood. But uh, what, do I, what am I meant to do with this? Am I supposed to understand what this says? Like, am I supposed to understand what this means? We're getting out of here. We're leaving, never looking back again. I guess technically we did it because it's gone. How do we make a furnace? Furnace, copper ore, and stone. Dude, I wish you could TP. You know what I mean? Like, I'm trying to TP home. Like, having to walk- Oh my god, a slide! Oh, this is so cute. I can't even ride the little ducky. Oh my god, I can! Look at me on the ducky. It don't go nowhere, do nothing, but I'm still having a grand old time. Trust. Who is this? Little green-haired Hot Topic employee. Hey, girl. Caroline. Hi there. Do you have everything you need for the farm? Why is everyone trying to sell me something? If not, we might be able to help you out. Who's we, girl? We carry a variety- Who is we? You never even said who's we, so you're not getting my business because I don't know who you're talking about. Hey, what's- what's- what are you doing? Louise. What's- what's going on? Hey, I was doing my nightly rounds now to set your first parse and it was ready. Congrats. Is every, everyone's stalking me. Like that guy earlier who was like, hey, I've been watching you lately and I saw you mine some stone. Like, y'all are so weird. Get away. Like, why are you- why are you camping my parsnips? What- what is this? Oh, it's the calendar. It's Vincent's birthday. Everybody say happy birthday, Vincent. Happy birthday to you. You live in a shoe. You smell like a monkey. And you look like one too. Happy birthday, Vincent. I hope you have a great day today, Vincent. Oh, it's almost Haley's birthday, my baddie Haley. The egg festival. I am not prepared. I need to start laying eggs. Quick. Grandmammy. Who's this? I haven't met you before. Evelyn. Rich are the most beautiful family of butterflies selling themselves in the town garden yesterday. And what about it, Granny? Is that all you had to say? All right, baby. I'll see you later. <laughs> Granny, don't don't stand too close to this graveyard now. You might see some friends. Ooh, was that mean? 
Did I not have said that? No, I mean, like, it's true. So it's like, whatever. What was I supposed to be doing? Making a, a, uh, a, a furnace. How do I get money, by the way? I only have 135, like, star coins or whatever they're called. Uh, do, do valley dollars. Like, you know what I mean? Like, well, I went to bed and I, and I caught a dub in my sleep, apparently. I got my scarecrow and I got whole proficiency. <laughs> Gotta love that plus one hoe proficiency. It was just incredible work. Hey, y'all. <gasps> we bought to make a scarecrow. Guys, uh, we have a little friend. Oh, and I got money for that. Dude, what a dub. All right, let's go put our scarecrow down. No, I want him like... Is that good? Oh, what a little cutie pie. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Literally, why am I being gang stalked right now? Like, this is ridiculous. Like, if one more person is like, I saw that you were peeing and wiping the other day in the bathroom. Well, no, duh, I was in the bathroom. Why were you in the bathroom watching me do that? Like, what is going on in this town? Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. All right, now I'm receiving, like, threats. This is ridiculous. Where do you tell me to go? My chambers are, are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. Okay, let's see. How can I find where this wizard lives? Hmm? Left of the... Oh, Jesus. All the way in the sticks, bruh. What the heck is going on here? Oh my god, it's Yas and Vincent. Why is it locked? I want to explore the sewers. Man, what is wrong with you? I think Gunther has the key. Gunther. Professor Gunther, the man who runs the museum, why do you think he has it? I don't think Vincent's a country. I saw a big rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for a big rusty old key. There's definitely an apple in there. One of the apple demons. There's something moving around in there. Stop shivering, oh my god. Poor kid's gonna get traumatized on his birthday. Uh, hello? Anybody home? Oh, I got... Jump scared. Wither Foxy was in there. Uh, that was just Mangle in the vent, in the sewer vent. So wait, what the heck? I've actually never been over there before. I was literally just trying to find the way to the wizard's tower. Yeah, what the heck? How did I get over there? Because I was here. And then I went through here. And I'm at Marnie's place like I thought I would be, but I wasn't. I was at the sewer. So where's the sewer? That's the sewer at the bottom, but I was nowhere near there. That's so- I don't understand this game. That was so weird. And who is this? Is this Penny? Oh no, it's Leah. There's wild food in this area if you know where to look. That's actually great advice, thank you. You're the first person to give me good advice so far. Instead of trying to sell me some garbo. Oh my god, we found it! Jeez Louise. Like 30 years later. Anybody home? Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your wig. Oh, you can't even see because my head's in the way. Alright, there it is, y'all. There's the tower. Did I jump scare you? I hope so. We're going inside. Rapunzel, Rapunzel. Oh, they're doing devious activities in here. This is about to be the worst voice acting you've ever heard in your life. Hold on. I, I am Rasmodeus, seeker of the arcane truths. Why do you Loki steal my business right here? Rasmodeus sounds an awful lot like my username. Me hurry between physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elephants. Elephants? This guy is literally just playing Dungeons and Dragons. Like he's just like LARPing in like an Airbnb that he rented from like Disney. It's the Tangled Tower that he's just like renting. So we can have like a DD and d LARP sesh. Keeper of the sacred chest. Mm, you get the point. Wait, I kind of ate that. That was kind of giving voice actor, right? And you, Unmower, the one whose arrival I've long foreseen. Again, stalker. Here, I'd like to show you something. What? Please don't whip out your magic wand. Behold. He makes the apples. Why is it crying? You've seen one before, haven't you? Why? Stop it from crying, please. They call themselves the... Junimos. Jun Jun Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Yeah, because you're creepy and you're weird, okay? And you need to go back to playing League of Legends. Bro just zapped me. He actually just flashbanged me so hard. Hmm? You found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Yes, I did. 
It was just like chilling on the floor. Couldn't miss it. It was like glowing the whole room and everything. Most interesting. Y'all be honest, would you sign me? Would you sign me to... Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. All right, well, I'm robbing you blind, by the way. I'm taking all your money. So, uh, yeah, and I'm taking this big cauldron, too. Safe travels, I guess. Oh my god, he's back. He took an express Uber, apparently, because how did he come back so fast? We found the note. We looks upset. We, the Junie Mo, are happy to aid you. In return, we have for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Mm -hmm. One with the forest? What do they mean? I don't know, you made them. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, caramel topped toadstool. Can you smell it? Yeah, I can smell it. It's actually fumigating the whole room, by the way. Drink up. Please don't tell me she's just gonna straight up drink it. Please do not tell me. Girl, have at least a little bit of self-preservation, please. Oh my god, I drank it. Oh my god, I chugged it, bro. I chugged it like it was Gatorade. Look, now I'm gagging. I'm actually gonna vom all over the place right now. And I'm dying. Yep, I, yep, now I'm having an acid trip and I'm tweaking out. Awesome sauce. And I turned into a tree. Great, just when the game started. I'm actually becoming a tree. Or I'm having like a mushroom trip. I don't know what's going on. This without any music is really like embarrassing. You've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. So now I'm like goaded basically. I'm untouchable. I'm buffed up. I got the forest buff, the forest magic buff. I mean, thanks. Hey Leah, you'll never believe what just happened to me. Okay, y'all, I think this is the perfect place to end it because I have some magical powers apparently now, which genuinely from the bottom of my heart, I had no idea this was a thing in this game. I really don't know anything about this game, but it's actually been pretty fun so far. I think I definitely had more fun today than I did last time because last time I was like, what the hell is going on? But this time it actually flowed better and I was like prompted to do stuff. I hate when games don't prompt you to do stuff. It's just like they send you to the winds and you just got to figure it out. Anyways, I could like this series because it's like chill vibes, you know? All my other videos are kind of like high strung, like up to here on 10, you know, crazy business. But this is like a fun, nice, chill, calm series. So if you want more, give the video a like, comment down below, um, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. What is that? Y'all see that? Did I use my hoe? Oh. It was Clay, apparently. Cool. You know, I know a guy named Clay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay.